Autocomplete is the feature in Outlook that suggests addresses to you as you type information into the to, copy to, and blind copy fields when composing a new email message. Now normally Autocomplete is a very useful function, but on occasion your Autocomplete list can become so full that Autocomplete actually becomes a hindrance rather than a boost to productivity. In this tip, we will examine three options for configuring how autocomplete works so that you can achieve maximum productivity when working in Outlook. The three primary ways you can customize autocomplete in Outlook are to 1. Delete a specific entry from your autocomplete list, 2. Disable autocomplete altogether, and 3. Purge your autocomplete list so that there are no entries remaining in it and then begin building a new autocomplete list. If you wish to purge a single entry, consider the following example. Suppose typing a W into the To field brings up two names and one of these names I wish to no longer have in the autocomplete list. If that's the case, simply select the name using my mouse or the up and down keys on my keyboard, simply select the name that I wish to delete and click the X immediately to the right of the name. That will cause that particular name to be deleted from the autocomplete list. Now returning and typing W in the To field again, we see that I have only one name left in the autocomplete list beginning with W. To disable the autocomplete feature altogether, we will need to disable an option in Outlook. From the File tab of the ribbon, I choose Options, followed by Mail Options, and then I scroll down in the list of options until I reach the grouping of options dealing with sending messages. Unchecking the box labeled Use Autocomplete List to Suggest Names when Typing in the To, Copy To, and Blind Copy To lines causes the autocomplete feature to be disabled. Of course, if I subsequently want to enable this particular option, return Check the Box and Autocomplete will now be enabled. Additionally, suppose your autocomplete list has many, many items in it you wish to purge. In fact, so many that you might find it easier to delete the entire list and then begin building a new list from scratch. If that's the case, from within Outlook Options, click the button entitled Empty Autocomplete List. Doing so will, of course, purge the autocomplete list in its entirety. Using autocomplete to its fullest can be a real time saver when composing email messages in Outlook. However, if the tool is not working for you the way you wish it to, know that you do have these three options for configuring its behavior. On behalf of everyone at K2 Enterprises, thanks for taking time to watch this video tip. For more information on the training courses we offer, please visit our website at www.k2e.com.